People around the country remembering Martin Luther King Jr. today. The holiday commemorates the civil rights leader's birthday. Dr. King visited Milwaukee at least twice after his historic I Have a Dream speech. He spoke at UW-Milwaukee about racial tension. Well, the only thing I can say is that Milwaukee has some real problems to deal with. And a number of events planned today around the area to honor Dr. King. Our Bridget Shanahan is at the Italian Community Center in downtown Milwaukee with a look ahead. Hi, Bridget. Well, Vince and Susan, I'm inside now where they are prepping for this breakfast. And by the size of this room, you can see they are expecting lots of people, about 500 or so, for the 18th annual YMCA breakfast for Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. And I'm joined this morning by Julie Tolan. She's the president and CEO of the YMCA. And, and can you just tell us a little bit? I, I know you're expecting Governor Walker later today. Um, but what are you really hoping um, to pass along to the folks who come out today? Well, Bridget, thank you so much. We are honored to be hosting this year's Martin Luther King celebration, the largest celebration of Dr. King's life in our state. So with, along with the governor, we will have several elected officials here. Our dream today is that we certainly celebrate a life and a legacy of extraordinary leadership, but just as importantly, that we encourage our Milwaukee citizens to have a day on, mm -hmm. a day of service in support of our community's well-being. And, and because this is traditionally a day a lot of people have off from work, a lot of the government offices are closed, but instead of just, you know, sitting at home and, um, you know, reflecting in your own way, you want people to get out and get involved. Just what Dr. King would have wanted, for us to be engaged in our community, for us to see and work with people side by side who are less privileged than we are, and for us to begin to make a difference in a whole cloth kind of way. And this is something that's happening at um, several different YMCA locations across the city, right? That's right. And we have identified, I think, up to six partners that we're trying to work with today, again, that we can channel our volunteer efforts so that we can have a real difference to made. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Again, Julie Tolan, the president and CEO of the YMCA, that Martin Luther King Jr. breakfast getting underway here at 730. And again, Governor Walker expected to be here in just a little while. Live in Milwaukee this morning, Bridget Shanahan, today's TMJ4. All right, Bridget, thanks very much. And up next on Live in